All right, welcome back to Risky Runs Through My Time at Porsche. This is episode two. Let's get into it. All right, excellent quality, nicely done. You can keep them. This was our axe and pickaxe that we acquired from uh, creating them last episode. It was part of our first part of our builder's test. Now, I believe hmm. we're doing the second part. If I remember correctly, your pa kept a very detailed account of the things he made. You might want to flip through his workshop handbook and see if you can find a diagram for the stone furnace. Stone Once furnace, you have a that's diagram, what we're moving. Just use it on the assembly station in your yard to start construction. All right, piece of cake. I think his head just went through the desk. That was funny. Um, all right, so let's run through town with our axe out like an axe murderer. Nothing to see here. Hey, gal. Nice to see you. Did you tell everyone to stop messing around in the courtyard? Because they all gone. Um, all right, so there's the building platform. This is where we are going to be uh, building the furnace. Yeah, the stone furnace. Um, yeah, so let's check out the assembly station. Okay, so this is the workshop handbook. This is the one my dad left me. Uh, let's get into it. Welcome to my workshop handbook's first page. I'm going to try to write down all the knowledge that I'm going to gain as I travel this workshop business. I'm probably, since I'm probably the only one who's going to read this, hello to me, handsome guy. <laughs> so here we go. Lesson one is the most important. I just had the prez, the prez, Presley, help me construct my assembly station. Now I'm going to write down the steps to using it properly. Number one, go to the assembly station podium. Number two, open up this handbook and select a diagram. Number three, once the framework of the item appears, I can start placing the different parts. Number four, to install a part, I need to have the part in my hands. I'll walk up to the framework and the highlighted location and press the left mouse button to place it. I can cancel the assembly process anytime at the podium. All the used items will go directly into my inventory or sit on the ground nearby if my inventory is full. When I've finished the assembly, I can put the item into my inventory. Then it's payday. Yeah. Wonderful. Thanks, Dad. Thanks for all of your wisdom and advice. Okay, cool. So these are what appear to be... Oh, yeah. The DD Transport. We'll definitely be building that sucker at some point. Um, grills, water tanks. Um, I'm not sure if that's everything. I'm assuming it's probably not, but um, I really like how they did this little handbook, how it all looks handwritten, uh, but still gives you the information you need. Um, cool design choice. All right, so let's check out the stone furnace. Uh, we're gonna need 10 wood which we have 15, we're gonna need 10 stone, which we only have six. Uh, we do need to build a stone stool, which we get from the work table, and it looks like we need 10 stone to do that. Uh, so let's get out our pickaxe from our inventory. Things like caterpillars and snake berries and salad sauce don't need to be down here in our inventory. Salad sauce. Still curious what I can do with the salad sauce. Uh, current mission. Yep, we already know what it is. We're doing the second part of our builder's test. But we need to get some more stone so we can build that stone stool first. And I keep on to click that E button. Or the mouse button as quick as I can. Uh, level 2. We leveled up. Woo woo. Um, let's see what that actually means for us. Character. This. Okay. So... We have one skill point, and I said we should probably put it into our gathering stuff. So let's go with Mastery of the Axe, uh, just to knock off a little bit of the stamina that's going to take for us when we are using our axe. Uh, we picked up 20 stone from beating that rock down. So now let's see if we can build. Of course, it's not there. Uh, it sounded like, yep. I'll say, it sounded like the stone stool is going to be furniture. So let's craft one and there we go got some experience got our stone stool let's pull that out <laughs> why are we holding it like that behold my amazing stone stool what a nerd all right uh into our handbook we go so let's click build 
uh, the assembly true. With the relevant part equipped, aim at the silhouette of the con construct, then press the left mouse button. The assembly station console can be used to view material requirements or cancel the construction. Uh, parts can be installed or recovered when standing near the con construct silhouette, then pressing right mouse button. With all the parts in place, press the E key to pick up the item. Okay, so, uh, okay, place stone stool, and this is where we needed 10 wood, so we'll put that in our hands, place the 10 wood, and just like that, we have our stone furnace. Um, now if we equip it, nice, um, let's want to equip it, but I really don't like this tree that's here. Taking up space where I want to put my furnace. Yeah, so let's do it right here in the corner. Uh, it says we can rotate it. Yeah, I like it that way. Uh, and put it down. Cool. There's a little furnace. Uh, let's see what we can do with it. We can build some glass, some stone brick, copper bar, bronze bar, and some charcoal. Charcoal we can actually make some of. Um, okay, one piece of wood can fuel for an hour, it looks like. Let's put, I don't want to do, we'll do three. So we actually have some. Uh, and then let's build two of these. And that'll be all of our wood. Okay. So now I'm assuming that is going to take, yep, an hour a piece to get some charcoal. I don't know what I'm gonna need charcoal for, but um, since we have the resources, we might as well do it. Hey, May. Hello! You are, right? I am. I'm May. I work at the newspaper. See you around. A journalist, oh no. Uh, if let's you chat. know the latest happenings at Porsche, just check out the Porsche Times. Because you write it, that's why you want me to check it out? No problem. Let's play some rock, paper, scissors. We're all losing stamina. I don't think we had a ton. I am bad at this. Paper. Hmm. Hey, our first... Single, single win. Oh my god. I'm just never gonna... Okay. Alright, 2-2. Two, two. Champion. Winner. Oh well. Stupid game, she says. I'd be saying the same. But hey, for beating her, I did get a relationship point. So there's that. Sam... Hey there. Don't push. Haven't seen you around. Where are you from? I'm from Barna Rock. I met Sam. I did it. Um, I'm from Barna Rock. Yep. I used to call him Captain Arlo because it sounds nicer, but he didn't quite like the formality. Okay, I can't play rock paper scissors with you because I've probably played too much rock paper scissors for one day. Um, all right, let's get out of here. It is getting late. It is. Six o'clock right now. Uh, let's go find. Oh, Presley. Oh, there he is. I was saying, I see the little question mark moving around Good on the map. Job. You pass. Nailed it. This is your builder license. Congratulations. We did it. Woo woo. Now you just need to take this license over to the mayor's office and get your workshop registered. After which, you can start taking regular commissions. Come back Sweet. and talk with me after you register. Will do. So we need to go to the mayor's office. The Porsche government. Well, there you go. Nine. No, oh, I'm 45 minutes late. Uh, okay, but hey, the thing we're supposed to be talking to is slowly running up this hill, it looks like, according to our mini-map. Oh, and it's gone. Oh, no, it's not. Here we go. Gal's house. Oh, so Gal's the mayor? That little fat guy? <laughs> and that's his friend? Or significant other? Russo? Welcome, welcome! You must be the new builder. Risky. I'm yes. Gale, Nailed the mayor it. of this town. It is truly wonderful to see young people getting involved in the telesis of our society. Agreed. I'm here to register my workshop, though. Very well. What is the name of your workshop? 
Um, risky repairs. Risky repair. I can't put an S. Risky. How about... The broken chair. Are you sure my workshop to be called the broken chair? Yes. Builder license. We got it. Workshop, the broken chair, builder, risky. Uh, that has my birthday and the day I registered. Day two. Day two of moving into Porsche. We already got our builder's license with a stamp of approval from the city of Porsche and Mayor Gale. Nice name. Broken and chair. Nice name. Is complete. I thought so too. Thanks a lot. Also, we're going to have a fireside town meeting once in a while. Uh, they'll be announced through the mail. Try to make them if you can. You don't want me being the only one there. <laughs> uh, I will cover. Town I don't know if I want to be the only large, one there with him, the usual, though. You know. So we'll we'll see about that. I do wish that my town had fireside town meetings, though. Sounds kind of nice. Uh, all right, hey, Russo, my friend. Stretching out. Let's see what your deal is. Are you new here? I'm Russo. Uh, I am. Oh, the mayor's butler. <laughs> That's who he is. Yes, I'm in a hurry to buy some food for Miss Ginger. Good day. All right. Sorry, buddy. Uh, tell Miss Ginger I said what up. All right. So now we gotta find Presley again. I'm pretty sure, even though it is getting kind of late. Um, where's he at? This way. Boop, ba doop, ba doo. Uh, nice. This is open layer than the mayor's office, at least. What's up, Prez? You're now a bona fide workshop owner. Your pa would have been so proud. Maybe he would. Let Who me knows? explain some of the processes for our trade. Go for it. Here at it. the Porsche office, we post workshop commissions every day on the board over there. Over here. Based on the speed and quality of the results, we make a ranking of the workshops every week listed on the wall behind me. Over here. There are other workshops in Porsche? Oh, yes. Adding yours, there will be five workshops in our jurisdiction. Five. Besides the ranking list, you also have a workshop rating. Porsche doesn't seem that big to need five workshops. The higher your rating, the higher quality the commissions you can get. Okay. But don't worry. If you have your father's work ethic, you'll Which be number I do. one in no time. Once you're done with your orders, you can pick up the commission fee from Antoine if it's from the guild or the respective person who commissioned you. Builders make most of their money from doing commissions through the Commerce Guild. But some just build items and sell directly to the market. That's fairly lucrative as well. All right, cool. So two avenues to sell anyway, my stuff. Anyway, since this is your first commission, I kept one just for you. Yes. Playing favorites, are we? Higgins, you already took one today. There are never too many commissions. Jerk. Good day. Look at the expression on her that face. Runt. We look infuriated. He's the owner of the current number one workshop. Brilliant businessman, but I don't like the way he does things. Well, Ugh, I'm Higgins. sorry. That was our last one to today. Take him down. Hey, Press, I got a job for you. Or not. What is it, Arlo? I'll take that job, Arlo. Captain Arlo. We're looking to build a bridge to Amber Island. So the mayor finally put up the money? Well, young builder here is up for the challenge. Young Risky, learn my name. Yeah, he figured that place could be a real tourist attraction. What with the haunted cave and... That's what's gonna pull the tourists in? The haunted cave? See if he has a bridge diagram in there. I remember he built a bunch. He does. If I it's saw. there, use it at your assembly station. After you're done with the bridge pieces, you need to go to the designated spot and assemble the bridge. All right, also, cool. And this is important. Her project is big as a bridge. You'll probably need to dive into the abandoned ruins to gather materials. We have one such ruin in Porsche. It's located at the bottom of the temple tower. All right, sounds like we're going spelunking or ruin diving. 
All right, uh, commissions. I'm gonna need a three shell necklaces. Phyllis. Ooh, we do need those rep points. What else do we have though? Uh, we're in need of eight charcoal for the store. Uh, all right, we're probably gonna go for this. Not only is Emily our love, it's also charcoal, which we started some of that. Um, let's field this last offer quick. Just see what it is. Uh, Martha, I'm in need of five wooden boards. Ooh, that one sounds really easy too. Uh, we're gonna reject it though. I like the benefits of this one a little more. All right. Let's go. If we, if we pick, <laughs> all right, I figured this would happen after the stone step. This is my builder's license. This is my builder's license. And we just run through town with it. Polly, Polly, Hi. big scary guy. Let's play some rock, paper, scissors. Uh, Yep, we picked a great place to play. I'm not even gonna be able to see. A scissor and uh, both went scissors. Yeah. I can't even read my opponent's face. That's the only reason that I'm losing. Hey, we got one. Oh, he's got cut up there. How is that? Am I just great or am I the greatest? No, you're an, not a nice man. Uh, I think I'm just gonna hold my builder's permit forever, just like this. Hey, the broken chair. We we do have a name on our workshop. Why the broken chair? Do you tell me? I don't know. It's a broken chair. We'll fix it. All right, let's gather our charcoal. We still need a bunch more though, so maybe let's use up the last of our 27 stamina. Um, chopping down some trees or some bushes more or less it looks like Whoop. okay we just got to make sure we do not go past zero okay Whew. All right, three stamina left. We are maximizing our day here. Um, so, when we still have two wood left, so that's good. Uh, charcoal, how many do we need all together? We needed eight, we have two. So we need to build six charcoal. That's gonna take six hours. We have enough wood for two hours. I think that's how that works. Uh, let's just put the rest of the wood in here just to make sure we have a fire burning. Uh, so when we wake up in the morning, our charcoal will be done and we can get this commission out of the way. Um, yeah. Maximized that. Uh, do we have any wood left? Oh no, because we put the rest of it into the furnace. Literally all of it. Uh, all right, let's go to sleep then. Uh, confirm. Good morning, world. This house is so worn. I need to fix it or I won't get a good night's sleep. Oh, and actually, so if you look down at our stamina bar, it looks like, kind of like in Stardew, if you stay up too late, our stamina is actually starting way lower than it should be. So... Uh, I think let's maybe next episode we'll make sure we fix that up uh, before the episode ends because we do want to get a good night's sleep. All right, let's collect our coal. Should be all of it because that cooked overnight. Ooh, got a letter in the mail. Oh, we got a bunch of letters in the mail. Okay, this one's from Antoine. Hey, Builder, at the end of the week, we need qualified people to inspect these products. To coordinate with this, we will not post any regular commissions during the weekend, uh, but feel free to turn them in. Okay, fair enough. From Town Hall, hello, new Builder. We'd like to remind you that Porsche currently has two authorized ruins for you to dive in, an abandoned ruin, number one, below the Church of Light, and a hazardous ruin in the collapsed wasteland east of town. That sounds like way more fun. Uh, for your own safety, all other ruins are currently off limits so 
it sounds like we'll be able to open up more um, as we go, which is kind of cool. Uh, this is from Polly. This is the big guy we ran into. Hey, new builder. I have a manly commission for you to help you get settled in. You feeling it? I'm in need of three copper blades for some of my furniture. I expect nothing but macho quality. Okay. Also, if you don't have one already, you'll need a grinder to create these blades. That's all I know about builder stuff. Love, Polly. You the man, Polly. Um, can I accept? I can accept as many of those as I want, I guess. Uh, this is from the Civil Corp. Hi, Builder. I just want to inform you that the Civil Corps of Porsche can take some commissions from you when it comes to gathering materials from hazardous ruins. You can post a commission on our board, on their commission board, in the Civil Corps building at the northern end of the town. There are some guidelines on the board that you should read after posting, or before posting a commission. That's all. Arlo, the Porsche Civil Corps. Um, okay, so if there's certain things I need, it sounds like they could go take care of that stuff for me so that's kind of cool um nope oh, there's liua just always running and pinky oh hey polly hey remington everybody's jogging today oh you're you're a big pink fat cat uh yeah we gotta finish this one up buddy and sonia i will talk to you later Let's, uh... Do we have to go into here to do this? Or I have to talk to Gail? Hi! Meet oh, and greet. Right. You should get to know some of the people living in this town for your own benefit. I've made a list of the store owners within the city walls. You should go introduce yourself. Alright, cool. So meet and greet. We'll take care of that next episode. To end this one, let's quickly go turn in our commission with... Antoine. Hi there. I know who you are. A beautiful I'm flower. Antoine. The Commerce Guild secretary. We'll probably be seeing each other a lot. <laughs> you do seem like a beautiful flower. Um, I need to turn in this commission. Oh, maybe. Okay, I do that over here. I didn't even need you, Antoine. Sorry about that. Um. All right. No. So, did I not complete this commerce commission? So I totally did. All right. Let's check the map. Mm, can I check the map outside then? <laughs> there we are. Um, so where do we turn this in? There's a bridge to Amber Island. The meet and greet. Meet and greet. Meet and greet. Meet and greet. Uh, Martha's Bakery and a fishing rod. And we got a lot of stuff to do here. More meet and greets. Meet and greets. Meet and greets. Um, so I wonder if I can tag. Go to missions. Let's, how do we unpin? Okay, yeah, let's, let's see this one. So this should be the only one on the map now. What is this trophy? Gift exchange. I don't even know what that means. Where do I turn this in? Is that Emily I saw walking in that field? I think it was. Do I have to give this to you, Emily? I'm running through a cornfield with an axe. I guess it's better than running like this. Is it the... Hello. Um... Ah, Commerce Commission. Whoa, you sure are fast and reliable. That's what they called me in high school. Uh, thank you very much. Commerce Commission. Nice. Um, she also had something else. The farmer. Hey, neighbor. Hey, neighbor. Do, you Do you have a minute? I've been meaning to talk to you. For you, Emily? I've got forever. I just got a new craft recipe all the way from Highwind. It's a box that can be used to cultivate crops. People in Highwind have right. been using it for a while now, and supposedly it's great. Can you build it and test it out for me? If it works, thank you. Absolutely. And here are a few seeds to plant. If you want more seeds, you can buy them from my granny's shop. Try growing them to maturity and show me the harvest. Also, I have a tip for you. Using fertilizer will help increase the harvest. I'll give you some of that as well. Right. Sounds wonderful. Uh, if you didn't know, Emily, I did get my builder's license. 
Emily, did you see my builder's license? Emily, Emily, my builder's license. Do you, do you care about my Emily? Do you care about my builder's license? Hmm. And with that, that is going to wrap up episode two of Risky Runs Through My Time at Porsche. Thank you, everyone, for tuning into this episode. Make sure to like, thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you would like to do so. Um, so you'll get notified when the next episode of My Time at Porsche is out. Until next time, catch you guys later. <laughs>